Holy. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, my bad, yeah. I was, uh, I was gonna plan to go earn earlier, but I was actually video editing this whole time. He's on a clip RL, it doesn't matter whether if it's a clip RL or not. It matters if she gains the same amount of energy. So I think if I recall, Jackal is um, 14. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2. Okay, yeah. So Jackal is 14. And. Four, five, six, twelve, <laughs> um, eighteen, twenty four, thirty, thirty, thirty two, thirty three. 34 34 hits Which should be the same as Biscuit, I think I mean, I probably missed the core or whatever that made the difference in that, but it was 36 on this good. But, uh, probably something similar. Oh, 
How's Bay looking so far? Cha. Do you need to ask that? I mean, she looks great, dude. Her design is a winner's design. It's a winner's design. Dude, I swear, all their uh, black skin character looks great, dude. It's like... I. I don't know what what they got going on, but like, it's just me, chat. I don't know. It's just me, just me. It's been one hour. Oh, it's been, is it has it been one hour since she's out? Um, yeah, I was um. Uh, to be fair, I kind of finished my video editing probably like an hour ago, but I was rendering and I was getting like computer problems, uh, so I was kind of annoyed by that. One tap. Shit. Oh, oh this is not gonna look good. Oh, this is. It's not looking good. Enthusiasm, chat. It's like 2 a.m. right now. Please. Please. Oh my god. Please scream, I love PvP for me. Please, this is our 50. I don't want to be. Uh, please don't make this a rem situation. I don't want this to be a rem situation. This is not. It's supposed to be a rem situation. Please, uh, I don't want this to be a rem situation. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Oh my god, are you kidding me? There, there's paid gems here. There's paid gems on the line here. 
there's paid gems on the line here. There's paid gems on the line here. Increased rates. Okay, there was free gems on the line there. Now this is full paid gems. Now this is full paid gems. Full paid gems. Wait, we, do, we, we haven't... We haven't even seen a single one. Wait. It's 70 pulls already? Huh? Not, 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 not a single... Not a single five star? What? One tetra, please, please, tetra, please, please. Are you kidding me? A hundred. You cannot. Don't do this to me. A hundred. Like double, double. Double. Oh my god. Hold up. On the aid banner, she's three letters. On on REM banner, she's three letters. On Bay banner, she's also three letters. The three three letters? You're telling me three letter characters is my curse? The eight banner got me 170 before I got her. And on on Rev 360. No. No, the three letter characters. Don't do this to me. Oh my god. PvP is also three letters. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, no way. This is her, right? Definitely her. No fake outs. Has to be it. Tetra, Tetra, Tetra. I love PvP. I love Fip. I love PvP. Let's go. Holy.
120? Wait, you're th wait, someone tell someone said Mr. Tim also took 120? Tim did it yeah. How many how many how many pulls he stopped midway. Oh he got her 120. Wait, so which one is which? Did he get her or did he ticket her at 120? Like, what? What? What do you mean he didn't get her, but then like he got her 120? Like, what? 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 Oh. Oh my God! Are you kidding me? Time to see seven. Yeah, no thanks. One copy is enough. I just don't want to be in like a uh, wish list hell for my collection, but otherwise it's okay. I'm good. MLB lobby meta. Yeah, I don't need that. I have this. I'm good, chat. Is she gonna be wishless by 1.5? Side story. What is this side story? Side story picks up from campaign chapter 14. You may have high difficulties if you haven't watched the prequel. However, you can still proceed without with the gameplay without watching the prequel. Specific teams. Oh. You could use from Moderna POV when she leaves. Oh. Oh, okay. So it's like it's relevant to main story, but it's basically, um, yeah. Okay. The side story. Wait, is there new content? See, chat, they're safe. They didn't want me to put out the video of me complaining about Nikkei. So they're like, we gotta, we gotta release the, we gotta release the content now. Wait, what happened? Where's my button? What happened to my button? Where do I access it? Huh? Huh? It's an outpost? Dude, why do I have to go to out? I, I swear. Like, there. That outpost is such a bad location. Because, like, nobody really looks here. Like in the command center, yeah, I get nobody really looks in, you go you don't go in the command center to access these shit. Like you have to go out of your way. Yeah, it's such a bad like place. Oh. 
Yeah, the thing is, like, it's not a player friendly location. Like, they could totally have just like a random pop up, like, you know, miscellaneous things. Like, yeah, just like, or probably in the campaign, if you click campaign, you don't immediately go to the campaign. It's just like, okay, story, side story, or um, side events or something, right? Like, you want it to be visible, you don't have... This doesn't make any sense. It's also in the home lobby. No, it was there for one time. And then it's gone. Yeah, we clicked it and then it's gone. Yeah, it's a it's a really stupid. Um, so, so what's the story about? All right, give me the TLDR. All right, we got some t cheerleading, cheerleading. Oh my God, it's Harvester. That's all I need. Is there voice acting on the side story? Yes. Oh, dang. I have to enable it then. Yeah. I mean, uh, is there any daily or anything in particular in the side story? Or we could probably hold it until like later. Cause I don't want to like do it and I got to do something else. It's short, transistor, but you can do it anytime, not daily, it's just transistor in frame. So I listen to story content. Cha, I went through the Pentacone story, okay? It's really short. Wait, is it only like literally one chapter only? Wait, what? Are like quite episode or talk about story when is persona 3 reload i don't know if i can um slot that in because we got the au then chronicles We got a. I've already. I already bought it. By the way, I bought the deluxe edition. Is already bought, boys. And that's gonna come in like. I guess it's gonna come in two weeks. But. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to finish Aiden Chronicles in. JRPG. Yeah. So Aiden Chronicles is kind of like a spiritual successor for Suikoden. For the Suikoden series. In particular, probably Suikoden 2 more. It's like the Suikoden 3 onwards were kind of in 3D. Well, 3 or 4. Can't remember. But uh, Suikoden 2 kind of... It has the style of Suikoden 2. I see it on Game Pass. Maybe I'll check it out. Oh yeah, definitely. If you guys have never played... So here's the thing, okay? Here... Here's the cool thing about that. 
you can recruit over 100 plus characters in this in that and you build a freaking base okay like we're talking about castle like you build your own like castle with and you fill it up with like real people and no it's not like a roguelike thing it's actual characters so like each character has like the, their own like way off to recruit them What game is talk about? Euden Chronicles. Just look a blight back, oh dude. I wish. I wish. Honestly, dude, listen, if they have like a lot of similarities with Sukuden 2, because that's that's basically the best Sukuden, really. Like Sukuden 2 is the best Sukuden. So like Fire Emblem. Yeah, I guess you could kind of say that, but um There's a little bit more kind of like war um building on on it i'd say like like you're building an army kind of thing so like I, and i don't know if they're gonna include those but basically um on the previous week of dance like you have you have those um uh, I guess features where it's kind of like like strategy game part of it the strategy game but it's not it's a JRPG there's like a mini game or there's a lot of mini games in it typically and i don't know it's just like there's just there's just a lot of things to do typically on on that on that series which is what i really like shimmy how far bought us a bunch of her not having cover I mean, like... Yeah, I mean, like, some people manage to make good use of, like, Falkwang or something on the Hellister, but I don't know, we'll see. Because, like, her kit... it's it's too defensive like there's nothing that so does offensively so it's like okay you helm has heals but also shares offensive and christmas mika has buffs that are cleanse but she also has attack buffs right so you would rather bring somebody that can provide something offensively also. It's like, why waste? Right. Uh, I don't have any more fire locations. Oh, I just used my paid gems. Oops.
Mm. Yeah, and I can move Rem here. Or Ram. Uh, do we have clay? Wait, we got two spots. No. Oh. A cheerleader not giving attack buffs? Oh yeah, that's true, huh? See, the kit doesn't even make sense. I don't know. I feel like it's such a waste of design. Um, it's kind of sad. Like, clearly they're putting in some filler just so that like, oh yeah, you guys can save your gems or whatever. But at the same time, it's such a waste of design. Like, why don't you just freaking make a a rerun so that we can literally save our resources? Why do you have to pump out a new character? Right? It just it's such a waste. Like. Right? Yeah, because now you have this character that's probably not going to be used by 99% of the players. Or maybe she's going to be good for PvP, but I don't know, right? Like... Actually, no, she's... I mean, her reload... Her energy gain was horrible. It's also not good. It's... So, so, she's not even good for PvP. Well, um, energy gain wise. Yeah, like, not. So, you're not clip reload because your energy gain was pretty much trash. Okay, here. Let me show you the difference. Okay. So let's put in the two basic clip reloads, which is Jackal, I guess Senti, and then let's put the um, Bay and Yeah, biscuit and sure. Let me even put Laplace in. Huh? So, here, let me demonstrate it. Okay, so nothing yet, right? So, for Jackal, so that's six. Eight. Right, so it took me 14 hits. 12 plus for two. Yeah. Now, let's see. Per centi. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Three, one, two, three, eight, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So fourteen also. So you see how it takes fourteen shots to get the burst? Now let's look at the non clip ones. Let's start. Oops, they managed to get a hold. But, alright. 
Let's go look at non-clip ones. Let's start off with Biscuit. I have 10. So 10. Twenty. <laughs> Thirty. Thirty-five. <laughs> now let's look at Bay. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's twelve. Eighteen. Twenty four. Thirty. Thirty five. So, she is not categorized as a clip, which, by the way, I'll, I'll show you another one. But okay, so Laplace, 9, 10, 18, 27 plus 431 So, I mean there's each not all rocket launchers are the same, I think. Uh was I hitting the core before? But I mean there's there's a clear difference, right? Like you guys can see how a jackal and senti this is there's a reason why senti is like very highly valued right in pvp and same with jackal alongside with jackal's like damage share she also has like an insane uh energy gain to give you an example basically these They are actually similar to sniper rifles, if you guys didn't know. So the difference is, obviously the difference is sniper rifles are can only really hit one, but uh, rocket launchers can hit multiple in PvP. But uh, just to give you an uh, example though, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eighteen. Seventeen. 
Is it 18 because you're hitting the cover? Oh yeah, that's true. Right, right, with the, with the cover. Because you hit the cover too. again 15 16 yeah cuz it hit the cover again here and then hit the cover there so that was like two shots but oh, that was 18 so in any case you guys now see the difference on the energy gates and energy gate is extremely necessary for pvp on top of that bay also her skill and her skill one and skill two requires her to burst. So like it doesn't make any sense. You have a energy gain or you have an abysmal energy gain, but for your skills to even matter is you need to burst. So like, what are you doing? Right? What what's your purpose now? Like that means that you're gonna need other units that's gonna be carrying your burst for you. So that means you're gonna need other rocket launchers together with you. Like what's your purpose? The thing is like the clip shotguns or the clip shot the thing is the clip rocket launchers that are have high regen are in burst too, by the way. Because that would be Anise, uh, Noah is kind of good too, Senti is also, and then Jackal also. But then Jackal already does kind of like something that she already does, so you wouldn't really put her with Jackal. So like, what's your purpose? What the hell is your purpose? Sky, her damage here works differently from Jackal's, but you're gonna use her in the same regards as Jackal's. Well, okay, like the ideal situation is to use her in the same regards as Jackal. Er, sorry, okay. That, okay, no. I know Jackal, you're using it to proc shit and stuff, but... The ideal situation is for her to be tanking. And here's the thing, she doesn't recover the cover until the full burst ended. So during your burst, she's gonna recover, she's gonna increase the max HP, and then she's gonna start sharing damage, but then she doesn't start recovering the cover unless, un until after full burst. So that's like 10 seconds after full burst and here's the thing it's only effective to covers with remaining hp so after the full burst okay hear me out after the full burst 
you might have zero HP, zero cover HP already. So then how are you gonna recover the cover HP when you have zero cover HP? After full bursting. Because, you know, 10 seconds, the fight by the end of 10 seconds, that's pretty much done. Her kit works great after the match is over. <laughs> PvP combo bi biscuit? If the match can last until the second burst? And also, you guys saw. That's already with these two. Which have abysmal energy gain already. Comparatively. So you're gonna be positioning her this and then Biscuit is like here probably. And yeah, you're putting in two bursts already. And you have nothing offensively. And then okay, let's start like tanking also, I guess. So like we're gonna yeah, revive, so maybe Rapunzel to revive you. But the thing is, she doesn't have taunt also. Which kind of like, come on, just just put taunt. Might as well just put taunt with it, right? Like, why, why not? And... Yeah, I don't know. Um, the thing is, so if you want to burst again, so that means you need another burst too. Or burst one. So on either that or you have to take a burst one that's like... You have to take a burst one that's 20 seconds. So that means like you don't... Yeah, because you can't use Rapunzel. Cause like that means you're gonna take another burst, burst one. And because you want, if you want to biscuit to burst again, but then you're not gonna be able to full burst again. So like you need another, like it, it defeats. It has to be a twenty second burst one, so that you can do bring two burst threes. Yeah, Pepper, that's the thing. Yeah, it probably is Pepper, but Because like he has a decent energy gain Like are you just like gonna try to outlast your opponent by just over that ta just tanking a lot And here's the thing your bay will have intrinsically just have less CP because God forbid you're gonna pull more than one copy of her. So, like, you're gonna be on the CT CP disadvantage already. And, yeah, uh, what, what else are we gonna cook here? Because you, you probably want either a rocket launcher or a shotgun at this point because you you already have abysmal energy gain with these two.
Yeah, I'm gonna wait for Karipu's. <laughs> Let's just wait for Karipu's kitchen. <laughs> yeah. I wanna wait for Karipu's kitchen and then like, we'll, we'll see. Sustain team. Yeah, are you even gonna bother upgrading her skill too? Also, like, imagine upgrading your skill for like, there's nothing that you can use her on PVE. So you're just gonna be upgrading her skills purely for PvP. Is she bad for PvP? If you stack so much defense for the team, you might cook something up. Oh, also, because why would you even use biscuits here? I'd rather do, I'd rather do this. I'd rather just use Moron. Moron biscuit is way better too. Cause you're gonna be, you, you, you're cooking up a electric team instead. Like, I can't even justify spending resources on her. Skip unit. Yeah, you're good. You guys are good. Yeah. 100% skip like god unless you're doing collection or pulling purposes god like don't even bother 100% skip like and, and even even if say she would end up being good I don't know um I think it's still better to just like save your resource and then just uh just wishlist her because there the thing is there are many units also that you can that are good on both pve and pvp right in fact a lot of the units that we use in arena are those units and the reason why that is the case is because we also invest skills and energy on them. We, we spend skills, we spend overloads, we spend like things. So they will have naturally higher CP. And with them having higher CP, it will also prevent you from getting two CP suppressed because let me show you what what the CP suppression looks like.
Let me show you what a CP suppression looks like. When you have too high CP, it doesn't matter what comp you use. <laughs> oh god. They have a biscuit on their for their jackal. Let me, let me see something that doesn't have biscuit. This one doesn't have biscuit in it. There. Like, like you just tap them. In fact, it's a common strategy for SP Arena that if you don't, uh, you do for a lot of people that doesn't have a lot of teams, they would just build team A and team B and then their third team, they're just gonna put in like a high C like high CP team on it. Although some people can like do it, it's just sometimes it, you know, it can save you from dealing, having to deal with some hassle on it. right see the most see look at what these people have used though right for their pvp they have summer anise they have scarlet there's red hood so like there's obviously there's the defensive ones noah biscuit jackal those don't really get used on outside of pvp for the most part My SP Arena full of Leviathans. What's the best PvP team right now? Credit card. Oh sheesh. I haven't done my interception yet. I need some rocks chat. I'm like, I'm down bad from rocks. Can get some gobble rolling in please? I just realized there's a there's edge it just happened that's why oops
Trying to get your gone vision. Did these shop? It's kind of boring. I'm gonna lie. I don't know. I mean, yeah, it's asking too much for a gacha game, but. The side story is pretty good. How long is it? Has the shop been the same always? Uh, that's gotcha 101 I let the VA play out about like an hour of just letting it auto oh okay so okay that's gonna take a while though okay so I'll, I'll, I'll save the story for later then oh I just do it how's bay I already go back like maybe 10 15 minutes ago. Oh, shoot, I didn't do the red hood one. Red hood one's better. I guess it doesn't really matter. Scalter just uh, destroys. <gasps> Ooh! Wait, that was my only abnormal support armor. I guess I used the last one on Rem. Okay. I guess that's not bad. Guarantees that I have. Ooh, rock. Yes, sir. Easy rocks. Double rock. Bam! Hell yeah. Okay, we got a we got a gear that I don't have, and two rocks. I, that's a W. Where's Karipo? Where's Karipo when you need him? He gonna be testing on the way though. You know, before Karipo was testing on me, but um. I I got out leveled. I can't, I kind of I stopped spending on uh, resources. Or by resources, I mean for core dust.
but then I ended up not being anymore the d training dummy where's Coco hey my Coco is core 5 now Why does Coco look like the Nyan Basu character? Well, I always think I'll always think like that. Okay, I finish it. Okay, I'm done. And I'm done with my more least too. Need to revamp special interception. <laughs> yeah, you and me, bro. We talked about it a while ago. Where is it? <laughs> yeah, where's our interception EX, huh? So that we get more rocks. Are you done testing? I can't realistically test her on my account. I don't really have any PvP units. So you can't really. It, it's it's kind of like. Uh, At best, we can look at into the mechanics behind it, which is... Hmm. Actually, how can we test that? Oh, I think I have an idea. I can... We can test her in... Where can we test her? I think I dust her on Nihilus there. Advice? Uh, well, they're putting in the automatic advice, right? But the thing is, like... Dude, their dev notes are so... Like... What are you doing in a month? Like, I can't... It, it, it's so like what are you doing what do you do The thing is, like, they're. Well, the thing is, Shift Up is acting like they only have one developer. That's how. That's how slow their progress is.
I think Genshin waited three years and a half to a basic. The thing is, Genshin. It's the same thing for Genshin. Well, plus or minus is roughly the same thing, but I mean, there's there's like some new freaking game mechanics that they're implementing, which is fine. The quality of life things they didn't implement until like people complain from about after seeing what Honkai does. But the basic quality of life thing is one thing that feels more kind of like, yeah. It's like it's like a bug fix, but not really. But their their quality of life things, but. You can't say that Genshin was not implementing new mechanics into the into the like their open world thing. They literally have every six weeks, so like, well, not other than new character. They usually have a new story and um so to speak campaign right like it's like the follow-up for their campaign and then there's typically like there's so many interactables in the exploration in genshin that's like new things but look at nike there's like nothing new for the past year and I talked about it already. I'm gonna talk about it again. For the past year, we did we did we, we didn't really get la anything. After Solar Ray, there was like nothing going on for what one, one year. So you had Liberation and then Union Raid and then Solar Raid, but then after Solar Raid for one year. The only thing that we got was simulation overclock and it wasn't even fully out and the thing is that was, yeah that was like one thing and then like a lot a bunch of mini games i feel like unable to scale is the problem of all gacha it's not unable to scale it's the it's the not wanting to scale because they're in money making mode if you have done a reasonable amount of game development you can implement something okay i'm not i'm not gonna be speaking for whatever it is but People have made uh, like something that is just doesn't even exist. They can make something move within less than freaking ten minutes. Well, not ten minutes. Okay. Well, okay. I'll, I'll give it a day. Sure, you can make something move within a day. Are you telling me like within a year you got nothing to show? And the minigame is complete again, like the minigame is something completely different. You can have that like a separate team for that. But the thing is, again, they're just focused on new characters and then the stupid ass minigame and then the story. But then like what okay, what what is something new mechanically in the story? Or even like daily feature. It's not that the gacha games don't scale. It's just they don't want to scale. Because okay, here here think think about it also from their perspective. Why would you put effort when you can gain the, get the same amount of money 
by not putting effort. Just put in like some fucking Coomer ass like character and people are gonna pull the shit out of that. And then they like all things are good. Why put money in Nikkei? Where can that money gonna go to Nikkei too? True. Um, we're pretty much investing in Nikkei too, actually. Send another truck. To be honest, the story and events is what gives it going back. It's really good compared to other mobile games. We're conditioned. Hope is lost to humanity. We are a part of the problem, chat. We're conditioned to be fine with mediocrity. When you got everything else that is shit in comparison. <sighs> We? Shut the fuck up, you're playing, you're watching a guy talking about this shit on a, about a mobile game. Yeah, we. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do I got MV, MLB? Why would I ever be there? There's a lot of units that I don't like. I don't get copies. I just let it happen naturally, okay? And the thing is, you don't really need copies of her. Actually, I guess you do if you wanna take advantage of her, kinda. Cause it's, they're scaling with HP and scaling with defense, so technically... Lobby meta? Why do I need the lobby meta again when I got all of these? I'm good chap. Champion arena soon, yeah, surely. Overload for defense? No! No! So her buff? Well, technically, it will in uh, work kind of like her, but her buff, this caster's defense, is not based on her. It's based on her base defense, not including the overload. It includes the gear, but it doesn't include the overload line specifically. I guess it kind of, I mean, she, she, since she damaged shares, I guess so. Okay. That'll kind of help. Reminds me of your mental breakdown episode, chat. You know what's a better? Me uploading this video. Look. It's ready to be public. A bit late. Like what, what does this even, what does me posting it early versus posting it late do? What's the difference? There's no, there's no difference. 
Yeah, it's a full video. Like, I would have put this before the, the, the guide video, if you wanted me. I could have put the guide video just now, if you wanted it. Doesn't you get more traction than you where the banner is? Yeah, but then I don't have- I didn't have time. I had to prioritize all these videos. Technically, these ones were just like because they were easy. Like the the Suyin one and the shift up thing, that, that one is like thing. But then the Nihilister, see I didn't even like edit the Nihilister shit. So I only have so much time. I, to be fair, it, this only took me less than a day to edit, but I still only have so much time. See how many freaking those cuts in there? There's a lot of cuts in there. I should honestly I wanted to edit it a little bit more too um, I was debating between like hiring an editor or not for him but I just decided not It's gonna be public by the end of well by the end of this stream. I wasn't really like I was gonna post it. Like the main reason you guys realize the main main reason why I went on today was not really for Bay. Was that so that you got so that I can give you guys the link for the video? Ha. Huh. Checkmate. Corpo move. So chat, is this like... Is this a real... Is this a real thing? Is her left leg fine? I... People on Reddit were saying this isn't physically possible because because I think what had to do is also because the thing is the the issue is the 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 waist didn't like move up right or the butt whatever it is and it was literally just like from the thigh upwards Yeah, you, yeah, you have to bend backward a little bit. It's only physically possible if she dislocates her leg. Yeah. Um. Yeah. They're clearly their artist doesn't know shit. I guess. Well, I don't know shit either. But you know, if you guys say it's physically impossible, I believe you guys. She is a Nikkei, she isn't human, I guess. I guess. True. Without the angle without moving her skirt up. Oh yeah, like why why did they even not do an upskirt of it? Right? Like it doesn't even make any sense. The thing is, like, maybe if the the skirt, the, if if there was an upskirt a little bit, then that that would have made sense. 
IPO sensor. Then they should just not have done that. I don't know. There's there's so many more ways to do a freaking like cheerleader thing. How is dude Twitch is like Yeah, hold up. Let me let me allow the word. Twitch. <laughs> if there was enough here, people would have said anything, yeah. There's an upskirt in the event banner logo. Banner? The burst has... The normal mission... Oh, in the normal mission? Huh? Oh, this one? Or... I would imagine someone has the actual data mine on that. I was saying, yeah. Stages of normal event. Oh, you mean this? Come on, we need it. We need the animated chat. Says that she kind of sucks. Yeah. That's her burst, right? Oh, she has a completely different burst. Oh, well, let me go to Mini Sky. Watch her. Watch Mini Sky just get it. side story chat you know when you go to a main main story quest there's a side quest I know it's crazy so it's, it's a revolutionary concept Nikki had would have never thought of it
crazy. What the fuck, D? Dude, why is it so small? <laughs> What the fuck? Bros. Work hard. Favorite mini game? Barbecue. Where the fuck is barbecue? Barbecue. Barbecue or Mog? I, I'd say barbecue. I like barbecue more. The barbecue is better. Snow White Memory. I would have voted Snow White Memory, but like we're talking about just the mini game. But... Yo, fuck this Snowfall Oasis shit. Worst event. Shit was like eating up so much of our daily time. Wait, did we have to share it? Shoot. I didn't share it. Yes, yeah, share. Sure. How do we get it back there again? Oh, here we go. I think I shared it. There you go. Yeah, I mean, it's just a regular ticket. I haven't done it on my main yet. I need to do it. So you know, Mini Sky is so lucky. Watch this. One ten pull. That's all we need. Fuck, never mind. Okay, that's fine. That's all you get, Mini Sky. I'm not gonna intentionally scuff myself. Sky, dude. In a way, I don't have the mental capacity to. And even then, you know, the only one of the reason right now that I'm just doing this is. By the way, Sky. No, yeah, sorry, what did it say? Sorry. Guys, uh, Sky Falls recruiting, please. Like, uh, Sky Fall, any. Any level 200. <laughs> Or 300, 200, uh, 
one. Like maybe three forty one. Maybe. Make a global union. I love that. That's too much work. I'm not gonna be able to properly help you guys. It's too much work. Half anniversary uh, predictions. Crown Limited. No, they shouldn't make a Pilgrim Limited. That's Pilgrim's already freaking hard to get. And then Limited on top of that? That's ridiculous. Shift up, write that down. No. Can you get Dorothy? Yeah, I think there would be a Dorothy banner. If they're gonna do the same thing as like... Um... Like Scarlet Black Shadow. Also, is it just me or are they gonna just keep doing this? We're gonna get three pilgrims every year. So we got half anniversary and then the next pilgrim is going to be anniversary and then actually it makes sense because the summer is filled with limited units. Actually it makes sense. Cuz so they have half anniversary then summer limited units and then anniversary and then like new years. So I feel like there's just going to be three opportunities for pilgrim every year. If they're gonna con uh, if they're gonna follow the year one route, unless they make Pilgrim Limited a summer pilgrim, I could see a summer pilgrim. And if they make it limited, though, I could see them making it a two percent instead of a one percent. I could totally see it. I think the limited will proceed supersede the pilgrim rates. I think it I think it's just an, it would be unfair otherwise. Ragnarok Colosseum. Yeah. From time to time, I do play some Ragnarok Colosseum. Summer Snow White, please, thanks. Why be fair? Well, I'm trying to be reasonable here. I mean, limit the the stat the state of limited already is a lot. Right? So. I think it's something that would make people happy rather than like, are limited and then pilgrim. It's like. I mean, it's either that or if they want to decide to just go Pilgrim, full-on Pilgrim, then, yeah, just don't make it limited. It's a summer theme, but it's not a limited unit. 
a summer themed pilgrim that's like forever I, I wouldn't mind that but also they they gotta be wary because giving the the pilgrim rate means that they have to make that's gonna shift the meta yeah you have to be careful with that At this point, limited pilgrim will only make us happy. The only caveat is it has to be strong, right? Well, I guess any pilgrim status it has to be broken. That's a thing. Like that's a that's a character that's an expectation now. They're not gonna dare go do freaking um Red Hood 2.0. <laughs> yeah. Red Hood Gate 2.0 Dude, we farmed the shit out of Red Hood, dude. Like there was like a video every day or two until they fixed her. <laughs> That's my main goal for Mini Sky. Get the dailies out. for bay how many pulls did it take you were you doing it for collection actually never mind that i asked everyone's doing it for collection <laughs> I 
I'm serious. That's awkward. <laughs> It's definitely summer. Desert Bond story. I'm pretty sure someone will upload the Bond story. Isn't there someone who usually like uploads those Bond stories? There's like some YouTube channel with that. Gotcha sing, but don't door. Wait, what? Really? I mean, that's a smart thing to do, though. Like, you know, you're gonna get her eventually. And if you really like her, you know? Although, um. Part of me thinks that. Actually, hmm. We still don't have a stable Team 5, so. And I think, I think it's going to be a lot more common soon to have Rem as uh, Team 4. Or Team 3. Or Team 2. Not Team 1. Tianaga is still Team 1. The, the, the shield, the healing, the... Like everything that they provide is just too good. Even Team 4 is still random. Well, so like Ram Team will all. I have a good feeling that Ram Team. I think it's gonna be a consistent situation where we're gonna put Litter with Scarlet Black Shadow and Alice. And Rem, I yeah actually even for, yeah, and uh, the last one will be Flex on that. I think he's gonna be consistent. The bunnies. The main restriction on the bunnies is... You, you don't... you only have two slots, two slots for DPS. So I think they're gonna flip-flop in terms of like DPS. And the only reason why the biscuit team is the biscuit summer anise dorothy team is up there is because of their survivability they have insane survivability and the damage is just consistent because um, because summer anise just does damage even though she's shotgun a big chunk of her damage also just comes from that. And same with Dorothy. It's like they they just all do like decent damage. It's 
So, I mean, if we're looking at like the most consistent team two, really, it's um, it's the Dorothy Biscuit Summer Needs. A support version of Privity, yeah, that's a, that's gonna be just broken. I feel like they're they're intentionally not gonna do that. I I actually think they're gonna intentionally just avoid that situation. Cause that would be too OP for that team. I also wonder how much that team is gonna be nerfed because of Biscuit uh, Rocket Launcher nerf energy gain because a, a big chunk of the energy gain from that team comes from Biscuit. It's 4 a.m. So we're gonna, we're gonna chill for now here. Basic treasure for Brevity. I don't think they're gonna remove. I don't think they're gonna remove or make Brevity. It's 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 gonna go. The treasures are for underused people. And Privati is 100% use. Like she has like a 100% usage rate. Our boys' video has been posted. GGs, thank you all for chilling. Go ahead and support that video, please do. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be for me today. Oh, what's uh what's our comment to to do Oh, I didn't. I didn't really like showed it, but my RAM is 10 10 10 now. A long RAM. You know what? I'll just do it like that. All right, we're better than Amelia. Let's do that. You fucked that. All right, who's first comment? Oh, I don't know who's first comment between you. Anyways, chat. GG's. GG's. Thank you all for chilling. Chat, I actually... This one was pretty well edited, okay? At, at, at least I tried to edit it a little bit. Okay? Well, just just a little bit. Not, not so much. I thought that I tried to base it up well, which is pretty fun. Anyways, GG's. Thank you all for chilling, chat. It's been a good time. GG, GG, smash or pass, pass. Go, 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 go pass. Uh, like, save your, save your resources from Bay. Okay, save your resources from Bay. Oh, hang over, chilling chat. GG, GG, GG. That's gonna be it for me today. It's been fun. Um, I'll, I'll see if I can put up something for Bay, but I'll probably wait until Karibo finishes it. I'll, I'll probably wait until Karibo.
puts up like his comments and ideas on bay and then maybe maybe we'll have something um but yeah chat thank you for chilling go ahead and go check that video out it's been good thank you all for chilling um mm -mm -mm. Oh. All right. Well, GG, GG, GG. It's been a good time. That's going to be it for me today. And I'll see you guys next time. Video, video. Share that video. Like, watch that. It's edited. Peace.